who wait for the vaccine's final approval. Tonight, uh, there is a new treatment option for certain COVID-19 patients. A new therapy is being distributed all across Alabama, including here in Mobile and Baldwin counties. NBC 15's Andrea Ramey joins us live now. Andrea, this is for folks who are at the highest risk. Right, this is for people with COVID-19 who are maybe older or with underlying health conditions. Infirmary Health says it's gonna start offering this treatment starting tomorrow. These Eli Lilly workers are manufacturing a new COVID-19 treatment, bamlanivimab. It's a new therapeutic IV treatment. This will hopefully be an agent to keep people out of our hospitals. I know that it has been used here in Montgomery already and, and uh, apparently with good success. It's given to people with the virus who have moderate symptoms now but are at high risk of later becoming hospitalized. Certainly persons 65 years of age or older and persons who have certain underlying health conditions. For example, uh, diabetes has been a very big concern of mine in COVID-19. I'm really urging all of our diabetics to take special precautions. The state received a thousand doses last week and more is on the way. Infirmary Health says as of today, it has 170 doses that will be used at Mobile Infirmary, Thomas Hospital, and North Baldwin Infirmary. In a statement, Infirmary Health said it has established outpatient infusion clinics at each of its hospital to administer the therapy. Patients must be referred by a physician and will be scheduled for infusions as supply allows. Uh, around 40 hospitals uh, have placed orders and will be uh, receiving that drug in the next, next three days or so. Assistant State Health Officer Dr. Karen Landers says the therapy is promising, but the goal is to never have to treat the virus. Let's prevent all the COVID we can so we don't have to involve these therapeutics. Uh, this treatment is not meant for people who are already in the hospital, but because this is an IV treatment, hospitals will be administering it. Reporting live in Mobile tonight, Andrea Ramey, NBC 15 News.